Hi, this is Brandon from Whiskey Tango Farms. We're here to help you on your path to self-sufficiency through Katerns quail, rabbits, and gardening. Today we're going to pack up some eggs to ship out and show you how we do our shipping process. Today we're going to send eggs to Chris from Slightly Redneck. Uh, Ed got bait donated 30 Jumbo Wild eggs to Chris. So we're going to pack up uh, the eggs and we're, I'm going to show you how the pack, we pack them up and send them out. I figured, you know, since we're sending eggs out um, and you guys might want to see how we pack our eggs in, for shipment. So I'm going to ship them up and send them out. All right. We ship in these large foamers. We have 60 eggs here. We're going to send Chris 60. Ed got bait donated. 30 eggs and shipping, and I figured why not we had some extra jumbos that um, we aren't able to throw in the incubator because we just got a bunch of other eggs. We got a bunch of jumbo Egyptians to throw in, so we don't have room for these ones. So they're going to Chris. So we ship in a layer of foam like that, like this. We include a hatching guide and a sticker, and then we double box them, so we have a smaller priority box inside a bigger one. And we only do this on the smaller orders like this, 60 or 120 eggs. Um, they just go right in here. So lay the bottom foam down. Then we throw in eggs gently and then throw the top foam on and then the hatching guy goes in here like that the other thing we throw in here is a business card and then we pack them up so take some Packing material just to fill an empty space. Don't need much. But... And that's it. That'll be the box. I'll tape it up, put his name on it, and then we always write on the sides. You know, fragile and everything. So we got all those on here. Um, next, all I have to do is put his shipping on there, which I'm not gonna show. Again, got it all here, all on there, ready to go. Got our writing on there, future baby quail. That's gonna go off to Chris. Also got a special package going off to Verna. Verna ordered some eggs from us. So thank you, Verna. So those are gonna go in here. She's a small, smaller order. It's only 30 count. So I'm just gonna ship it in a smaller box. Um, so it's not so big. But that's going to get our sticker, Whiskey Tango Farm sticker. It's going to get our hatching guide. These ones we do have to fold. So, our hatching guide. And she's going to get a business card as well, because that's what we put in every box. And then I will put some packing material here as well. 
packing material on top. Wrap this box up. And these are getting sent out to Ohio. So we don't normally ship in these smaller boxes. Only usually when they're real, they're smaller orders or they're they're um, winning orders, we'll ship in a smaller box. Alrighty, I'm get this labeled up. All right, now we got those packed and ready to go to the post office. Uh, we're gonna head there and ship them off. Um, so that's how we pack our eggs for shipment. Um, we do two different styles. Um, usually we do only send the, that bigger box with the bigger foamers, but we occasionally will small send the smaller foamers um, when they're smaller orders of like just 30. Uh, you can't fit any more than 54 eggs, I believe, in that smaller box. So that's why we had to send the bigger box. Um, and we usually send those smaller orders for uh, our giveaways that we do on our channel um, of our special eggs that, you know, either experiments or just, you know, a mixed hatch of eggs that we give away on those. So those are going to be off to Chris from Slightly Rednecked and Verna. Uh, Chris, uh, most of his quail got eaten by a fox uh, about a week ago and you know he needs some more eggs uh, to build up his stock as most of his birds got wiped out and Ed got bait donated 30 eggs and we decided to donate another 30 since we couldn't incubate them uh, this week we had a order of some eggs that we got in for um, us and then we also were hatching out some other eggs haven't got the refrigerator um, hatcher uh, running yet it's close but it's gonna um, be done here hopefully this weekend uh, if you liked anything in this video if you like this video at all um, just hit the thumbs up button uh, subscribe to the channel hit the notification bell select all for notifications um, for any of the new videos that we produce we try to come out with a video at least once a week sometimes we take a week off just because I'm busy but again, we try to get a video out every week. We're live every Wednesday at 7 p.m. Central um, for Whiskey Tango Talk. Don't forget to um, see that. Uh, me and Kristen will talk about your questions that you have with homesteading, rabbits, uh, quail, gardening, any of those type of things. Uh, we will have gardening videos coming up here in a couple months. I know it sounds weird, but I will have some videos starting in a couple months because that's when I start my peppers, um, usually around February to March. Again, I'll have an update for the refrigerator here soon and how that's going. And thank you for watching. Bye.